What I plan on doing is just going through uh, my uh, own original songs and kind of talk about them. There was a program I used to watch on uh, on uh, Palladia. It's called uh, Storytellers, and on there they would have the different artists and they would uh, do their songs and they would talk about them, kind of like the background of them and how they came to be. So uh, I'm probably going to ramble a little bit tonight and uh, talk about these songs. So yeah, like the first one, uh, and I'm gonna do it in the, in the original, in the in the original uh, way that it started. The uh, I was up on my back deck, just playing around with my guitar, doing something like this, and my cat comes out there and he likes laying out in the sun, and. Uh, and he's always jumping up in the windows, lays in the window, looking outside, you know, when I have a window open. Gets up on the railing. And so, uh, he's a big black cat too, pretty cool. And so I just kind of like was uh, checking him out and I thought, this is, the, this is the song that came out of it. So he was, this was my inspiration, was my, my cat, my male cat, Kuro. Which Kuro is the Japanese word for, for black. And of course my wife named him, so, uh, He's black. See, not fence. See, not fence. Watching time pass me by. Got a front row, see, yeah, yeah. Don't ask me why. I'm on this road and I'm taking my time Cause I know, yeah, there's only one more show to go Uh-huh, oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah Alright, I'll tell a story Go something like this On the road somewhere between here and there Got a front row seat Don't tell me why Already messed up that place Start all over again On the road somewhere between Here and there Can't remember where but I know Forever in my mind I'm on this road and I'm taking my time Cause I know, yeah, there's only one more show to go Uh-huh And every day seems to go my way Sun shining through the pouring rain Feeling high Sitting on the fence, watching time pass me by. Got a front row seat, yeah. Don't ask me why. Don't ask me why. Don't ask me why. Sitting on the fence. Inspired by my cat. So, thanks for joining. This next song is, uh, this song actually, uh, uh, 
came out of, of well, I shouldn't say watching the movie, I had the TV on, and I, and I just caught this scene, and this scene, when I saw this scene, it just kind of, I just thought to myself, well, how many times have I seen that before? And, uh, and I had this little melody, and I kind of was throwing around some words in it, but then I realized there's a, like a lot of these TV programs and movies and stuff, that's how they, that's what people do, you know, people write songs about it, they look at the scene and then they, they write a song about it. So I thought, hmm, okay, I can do that too. <clears throat> so this <clears throat> is my song of wine. Sometimes I wonder why Bluebirds can fly Why can I? Sometimes I feel So blue missing you Sometimes I wonder why Sometimes I just don't know Bluebirds in flight get cold Sometimes I wonder if you wonder too If bluebirds could fly, why not you and I? Sometimes I wish I could be where you are Sometimes I wonder why Sometimes I wonder why Bluebirds can fly like a Sometimes I feel so blue missing you Wishing I could fly back to you Wondering if you're wondering too Sometimes I wonder why Okay, we have to check that. Mm -hmm. This song is called Butterfly. And some of you that have seen my video before know the story that this actually was a thank you. <laughs> Damn. This uh, was an experience that had a butterfly actually landed on my wing. I remember reading uh, uh, some stuff about with, you know, Paul Simon was some of his writings and uh, Paul Simon said on writing songs, he said that, that to him, he said, it's important that you start with a truth. Because if you start with, a, with something that's not true, he said, then you're, you're having to cover your tracks every time you go back. But if you start with a truth, 
then your song will come through there. And I thought, yeah. And I mean, you know, the truth is that, and, and so I think what whatever people may think, not every song that a songwriter writes is about his own personal life. There's just, like I said, like that one I just saw that scene. And yes, now, our experiences are going to define how we interpret things. So you can't deny that. But, uh, and so this song, Butterfly, actually was a true butterfly. But then I just took it and I personified it with all the thoughts and emotions that I probably could, could put at that time. So here's Butterfly. <coughs> I was on my way, on my journey through this world. My eyes beheld a butterfly, so I stopped to watch her dance and whirl. However, gently she did go, with grace her wings she spread. And I had to laugh out loud as she flirted round my head. Closed my eyes and felt her touch as her wings caressed my face. My hands reached out to hold her close, but she darted into space. So once more turn the gaze to the road that laid ahead. I once more thought of life and love and where the journey led. I knew a song to gather songs of all that we had known. I knew no matter where we go, our hearts are not alone. I knew no matter where we go. Butterfly. I, uh, <clears throat> I've had the privilege and the honor to, uh, to write and sing at both of my son's weddings. Uh, and this is a song that I wrote for my younger son. When he got married. So to Eric and Kathleen. 
song is called Let Me Be The One. Look into my eyes And tell me what you see I hope you realize What you mean to me And I'm here to tell you Before God and man This road goes, I won't let go of your hand. So hold me and take me, let me be the one to hold you and make you truly understand. When I look into your eyes I'll tell you what I see A life lived in paradise As long as you're with me So hold me And take me Let me be the one to hold you and make you truly understand my love, my love. In this moment now, as I gaze into your eyes, I see a world so pure and whole A love so divine Just for us Just for us So here we both now stand Before God and man For all the world to see That our love was meant to be So I will hold you Embrace you I will be the one To hold you Walk beside you Through all that God has planned Just for us My love Let me be the one I have to chuckle a little bit I'll tell you a story on that song <clears throat> So When we get to the church that morning I set, set up my guitar, went in the back room, tuned it up, and had a set, I had my stand there, and they had a chair set up with a microphone. Everything we did uh, the night before did rehearsal, so we had a sound check, so everything was left the way it was. And what I did, I, uh, 
I took my hat and I put it on the chair of the, where I was going to sit, and I went to my pew. So when it was time for me to sing the song, I got out of the pew, went up to the chair, put the hat on, and then I sang the song. But I was thinking afterwards, I was kind of like standing around, like when Andre got married, I had Kyoko there. She was kind of like guiding me, telling me what I was supposed to do and where I was supposed to be. So I have to admit, I was a little bit lost. And uh, uh, Kathleen's uncle is a priest, and he, uh, he was the one who performed the, the ceremony, which is really nice. So anyway, he, he's, he's, I'm standing down in the lobby, you know, how they all come by one pew at a time, so, you know, it takes a while. And he says, you know, you can stand in line now and greet people as they come out. I go, okay, that's cool. I, I can do that. So I get in line there with, with Rush and, and uh, uh, Joanne. And, uh, and he says to me, hey, that was a nice song. Very nice, too, that you put God into it. And I started thinking to myself, wow, do, uh, uh, do I look like that much of a heathen that I wouldn't know to put God in the church? <laughs> so anyway, I just thought that was kind of cute when he said that. So... Yeah, it was good. So my neighbor Nancy, I love her. So her and Chris were at one of my gigs and we were talking. And I said to her, uh, I said, yeah, I said, you know, is the more I started playing, this is early in when I was playing, the more I started playing, then I realized, well, th there's quite a diverse crowd out there, so I had to learn more contemporary songs. And, and so uh, I was telling her that, and she says, so does that mean that you're going to learn some Bruno Mars song? And I told her, well, I'm not sure if I'm there yet. Uh, I'm still kind of working on that. But this is a song that I wrote for her. It's called My Love She Keeps. And this is what I call my Bruno Mars song what I think a Bruno Mars song would sound like if I wrote it. In the stillness of night, I watch the sleep. My heart's desire is that I could keep this moment alive, this moment in time, this heart that I hold, this love of mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
In the stillness of night, I watch her sleep. I feel her heart, and she keeps. My love, she keeps. My love, she keeps. Yeah, yeah. Oh. When uh, some of you, if they're out there, maybe know that I, and I've shared this somebody's story before, so <clears throat> bear with me. Sit here rambling. But uh, I worked for an international company for quite a few years, and I was able to do uh, an extensive amount of traveling, especially in the year 2000. It's a very, very great year for us. But, uh, I, and I was able to take you up always been a lot, on, on a few of these trips. So we were in Italy and in France. And, uh, Switzerland, yeah, it was pretty cool. I was working, I was there on, on assignment, and then uh, some of the other guys would take their wives as well, you know, and so, uh, um, Emmanuel Raymond, he was French, uh, his wife, Muriel, was there, and she had a car. So Kyoko and Muriel became good friends, and then they were, they got to see Switzerland. <laughs> you, I mean, if you, you, you gotta think about it, you know, we do these little day trips, that's what you can do over there, because that's the countries that are that close to each other. Ooh, excuse me. So anyway, here was a, a trip that we did. Uh, we actually spent a week in Switzerland and a week in France. With the highlight being, the weekend was going to be spent in Paris. Well, the, our flight got canceled out of, uh, out of uh, uh, Switzerland. And uh, with the delays, and I mean, it just... Uh, we ended up losing the whole day, so we pretty much had one day, and I kind of like just decided, let's see how much of Paris we can see in one day. She never forgave me for that. She would tell me, I'll never forgive you for, for making me run to Paris like that. She just wanted to sit down and people watch on the Champs Elysees. So this is my song called Paris in the Day. Paris in a day, I sit, drinking coffee in a small cafe, Paris in a day, you sit, as you walk down the Champs Elysees, Paris in a day, we laughed, as we stood at the Arc de Triomphe, Paris in a day, I sit, what would Quasimodo say, the artist fell in love with you, as you left to fill the air, they left as you bickered with them over prices of their wear. Now and then they would look my way as if to slyly say, This woman of yours, my friend, seems to get her way. Paris in a day, you said. As we boarded another bus, standing in the autumn we watched the world go by. And as others chose to move below, when it began to rain, you moved closer to me. So we did Paris in the rain. Paris in the day, I said. Drinking coffee in a small cafe, Paris in a day, you said. 
As we skip down the Champs Elysees, there's the day we left. As we stood at the Arc de Triomphe, there's the day I said, What good was the more to say? We stood below the two to feet, amongst the scores of people. We looked up, we looked at each other, and we turned and wrapped away. We danced upon the scene that night under Paris lights, under stars that shone so bright. We saw Paris at night. We sat and watched the morning sun shine its light on Notre Dame. The guard was staring down on us, they to walk in the sun. And laughing and holding me close, I knew I heard you say that you would never ever let me forget that we did Paris in a day. Paris in a day. I said, drinking coffee in another cafe, Paris in a day, you said, as you danced on the Champs Elysees, Paris in a day, we laughed, as we stood atop the Arc de Triomphe, Paris in a day, I said, what would Quasi Modo say, Paris in a day, you said, would he turn and run away? Here's the day. This next song is <coughs> called Sweet Refrain. Actually, it was two poems that I wrote at one time. I was just kind of, I, 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 there was, a, I went to this phase where I was writing, like, I wasn't writing songs, I was writing poems, and I, I, I didn't join, but I entered this contest. Uh, there was a, a group, and I think they're still, they're still in existence. They were called something like the Hoosier Writers Club or something or other. Northwest Indiana, something like that. I can't remember. But they had a contest and I entered uh, one of my poems. I, I, I thought it did pretty good because I ended up taking third place out of 160 some entries. So I was cool with that. But the cool part was they had this, uh, uh, they, they printed it, they had a book made out of it. So it was a lot of fun. And then they had a dinner where they, you know, give out these ribbons, you know, so I give my ribbon. And, uh, and then they had, uh, the books available, so of course people were buying them, and that was my 15 moments of fame. People were coming up to me and having me autograph the poem that you know on the page where it was, which I thought was kind of cool. And I was feeling pretty good about it, till my wife made me wake up. <laughs> but that was a fun time. But anyway, so this was two of the poems that I put together, and uh, it's called Sweetie Frame. Gave my love a song to keep If ever we should part She in turn spoke not a word But gave to me her heart I gently took it in my hands And held it close to mine Her eyes played for the man while I but mark the time And like the sweet refrain That keeps on playing time and again You're never ever far away from me Your 
Your image lingers in my mind The times that we look upon And every time I think of you It's music to my heart If there was a song I wish somehow would never end Tis you and you alone, my love For you've been more than a friend And when the seasons all have passed These journeys which we start I once more think of you, my love and return you to my heart And like a sweet refrain That keeps on playing time and again You never ever fall away from me Your image lingers in my mind The times that we're apart Every time I think of you, it's music to my heart. Sweetie friend. Thank you, darling. <coughs> Thanks for joining. Here's a song. Hey, <laughs> well, tell your mom I say hi. <laughs> Thanks for joining. Here's a song that uh, entitled, I suppose. And I think back how this song originated. And the only thing that, that ever comes out in my thoughts is that this is the kind of song that you write when you're lonely and you're all by yourself and you're just trying to write a song because you're lonely. <laughs> Something like that. If that makes any sense. So this is I, I Suppose. I suppose if I try hard enough I could learn to see things your way And I know my love is strong enough And I believe all you say And when you hold me in your arms My kids go away I'm afraid if I stay.
Guess I just go along my way And hope you understand That all the hopes and dreams you had Are not just that man Doesn't mean that I don't love you so But you said you've heard it before Guess I just go along my way and let you close the door. So I'm not, <clears throat> I'm not a, a, a very fast songwriter. It takes me a while to kind of put it together and I gotta go back and kind of redo it. My little kitty's up on the counter telling me she's hungry, I guess. But uh, this song, if I wanna pick a favorite, I think probably this is, this is my favorite because it's such a simple little song. And it's my first venture in uh, composing in Spanish. Excuse me. Some of you probably might have seen the video that I made. Tuyo, which means you and I. So I was playing someplace and, and uh, somebody asked me to sing, you know, to sing a song in Spanish. And, and I said, oh, I don't have any. So I decided I better have one. So I said, I want one. So this is Tuyo. Oh, you 
now Spanish speakers. Here it is. Every time I see you smile, I'm reminded of the love I had for you. And every time you hold and kiss me, I'm reminded of the love you have for me. And here we are, with nothing left to say. Here we are, just you and I. Cuando veo tu sonrisa, mi recuerdo del amor que tengo por ti. Y cuando pruebo tus besos, mi recuerdo del amor que tienes por mí. Aquí estamos. Sin palabras para decir Aquí estamos Solo tú y yo Solo tú y yo Solo tú y yo Solo tú Well, I was planning on doing an hour, so I can squeeze two more in, which is what I got. So I, uh, this song's called Down the Boulevard. <clears throat> this one, this one I actually wrote out of a challenge. Somebody, I can't remember how we, we were downtown someplace in Valpo and, and uh, talking about songwriting. And uh, so I kind of wrote this. A spur of the moment type thing. And then it just kind of morphed into all kinds of things. And that's kind of why I, I, I entitled my, my uh, recording Stories of the Road, because at that time I had a lot of thoughts about traveling and doing stuff like that. <clears throat> so this is, uh, and then too, when I first uh, was started introducing it when I was at my, you know, playing when I was playing, I had, I would introduce it and I would tell people I have, actually had no name for it, it just I had named it. And um, so then I started making kind of like a little contest to tell people, hey, if you want to uh, give a suggestion, I'm open, you know. And so people would do that. At the end, people would tell me, would give me ideas. But it wasn't until I was at, it was at, I was playing like one night at Good To Go and, uh, and uh, uh, Chad Houston and uh, Nicole Hayward were there. And as soon as I finished playing, Chad just goes down the boulevard. And I said, that's what it is. So, thanks to Chad, it says down the boulevard.
And walking down this road I chose This road I call my own I could tell you everywhere I've been Though I can't remember where So come on now, take me by the hand Lift me up once again Oh, I'm just trying to find my way back home Yeah, I'm just trying to find my way back home Seems like only yesterday I was walking down the boulevard Thinking of the miles I've traveled up to now so far Can't remember why I stopped but I knew it was time to go Oh, I'm just trying to find my way back home Yeah, I'm just trying to find my way back home So come on now, help me understand Just where I stand on this road I'm on Take my hand and let find my way back home. Walking down this road I chose, this road I call my own. I can tell you every place I've been, though I can't remember when. And uh, now I remember too, we were in his car, and uh, he uh, he goes, yeah, that's a good line. I go, yeah, I like it. And we drove a little bit in silence. And then Rocco turns to me, goes, and he calls me cuz. He goes, hey cuz, I'm stealing that line from you. And I said, no, no, you can't steal it. I'll let you borrow it, but you can't steal it. So yeah, so then I just went home the next day and uh, I said, uh, I'm writing this song <laughs> before he does. And now he's like, actually, we, he, I gave him a copy of it and he, uh, he's thinking about uh, doing it with his band. Very cool. So thanks again for joining you guys. I appreciate you uh, taking time out. Hope you enjoy. Do one more. Go Kells if you're out there. So this song originated on one of my trips out in Arizona. I was going to visit a friend from Tucson up into uh, Ila, New Mexico. At one point we were like 8,000 feet above sea level. It was pretty cool. That's where you pull out your phone and you see no bars. You say, yeah, that's what that commercial is all about. So anyway, as uh, 
getting ready to leave, I got my brother's truck and my brother's always worrier about me. And rightly so, I seem to get lost at times. So he asked me, he goes, do you know where you're going? And I remember smiling and responding. I'm not sure, but I think so. So in the next five to six hour drive that I did into the mountains of New Mexico, this song came in, into form. It's called The Journey.